Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the Empress. I'm happy to be here with you guys today. All right, we're going to jump right into it. For the month of December, what is coming towards my Leos? All right, so these messages are going to be general messages. If they happen to resonate, good. If it doesn't, check your moon and your rising signs, okay? Um, well, goodness, the card just flew out. We have wisdom, which is better known as the hier the hierophant or the high priest in the traditional tarot. So maybe some of you guys are looking for some type of commitment. Um, let's see. What messages are there for Leos? Just let me know that they're Leos. The message is here. <laughs> All right. So Leos. Sun, moon, and rising for my Leos. For the month of December 2019, what messages is there for Leos? What message do you have for Leos? What messages are there for Leos? What messages is there for Leos? All right, so bottom of the deck we have conflict and defeat okay so maybe in some way shape or form you may feel as if there's some type of conflict going on that you may need to try to balance out so i feel like some of you guys are trying to balance a situation out okay i feel like you may feel someone may feel like unwanted or unloved you have the four of um, well, we got discontent and boredom and love, okay? And under that as well, we have moving on. So maybe some of you are in your feelings or sad because you may um, feel some type of way about some conflict that's going on and that you're trying to find balance on, okay? Maybe some of you guys are trying to find some balance in a situation, okay? Some of you guys, we got sacral chakra here, okay? So, I feel like some of you guys are wanting to move forward. We may have some deception and some envy here, okay? May have a little liar or sneak or cheat because we got the three of cups and the seven of swords. So, it's most definitely possibly third-party energy going on. And um, I feel like you know that you could do better. Or you know that you need to move on from this situation. All right. Maybe you're looking for some type of recognition. We got recognition and reward. Okay. So maybe you're looking for some type of recognition in a situation. Maybe you feel like you deserve some recognition for a situation. But there's conflict involved around the situation. Okay. There's conflict based around the situation. The situation is conflict and it may make you feel as if you're defeated okay right you feel like you deserve some recognition for the part that you played okay you played a role you played a part and i feel like you feel like don't forget about me i put my work in i did my part and i want to be recognized okay we got movement choices and decisions. So in the past, there was a need to make some type of decision. Maybe you were uncertain. But yeah, you want people to know. There's something that you want someone to know. Okay? Awareness. There's some truth that you want to be brought to the forefront about a part that you played. Okay? And then we have accelerated motion. Okay? So this could possibly be traveling. This could be going on trips taking a trip, or this is even communication coming in, okay? So we're going to grab a few clarifiers and get down to the nitty-gritty. The sun card, 
okay which is the card of leo okay so i feel like you work towards something you have built something you've planted the seeds on something and you're waiting to see that you want to see the growth the harvest of it okay but I feel like you want, you was waiting for some truth to be revealed, okay? Someone possibly has a situation on hold with this hangman, okay? But the truth, I feel like you want the truth to be revealed. And then you want to say it, and then you want to, it's like accepting the truth is what I'm getting here. Acceptance of the truth. Okay, so you've invested, you've put the work in, you've been cooperative. Why is there conflict here? We got the lovers. Gemini's energy. Okay, but this is possibly a decision between two people so maybe you feel like you're caught in a i did pick up that there could be third party energy okay all right and i'm getting the strength card and justice we got libra's energy and you guys's energy so maybe there's a need to find some type of balance or to get some type of justice or karma in a situation hmm Four of Wands. I'm getting um, a battle between two people. I'm getting like competitiveness energy as well. Um, someone here possibly could be married. Okay, I'm getting like fighting for a position or spot. For some of you guys, this could involve work. Okay, this could be something in regards to something that you built at work. Some of you guys are entrepreneurs, business people, um, or this could just be work related, but I'm most definitely getting like there is some type of stability tied to this or some type of business or a marriage. OK, and I'm picking up that there's like competitiveness energy. OK, so we have partnership and alliances here, which is the three of cups. OK, so that also symbolizes that there is possibly three people involved or more. Okay, why is the three, uh, why is the partnership and alliances here? Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. But this is also my other person energy, okay? And I keep getting that there's this, um, uni the universe is conspiring, I feel like. But someone started an argument. Someone started a battle because we got the Ace of Wands and the Five of Wands. There's a battle here, and I'm picking up that there's this competitiveness energy, okay? This could be involving family as well, but I'm picking up on competitiveness energy. This is what I'm getting here. Like, there's a competition between two people, two or more people. Who's the best is what I'm getting. Who did it the best? Why is the Queen of Wands here? Eight of Swords. Someone isn't happy. We got the Four of Cups. Oh, I'm even getting like depressed. Okay, I'm getting like depressed energy. Um, or someone is thinking about their actions. Okay, we got the Four of Swords, the Four of Cups. Lots of fours here. You could be seeing the number four, 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 or there could be four people involved in a situation. We got the Four of Swords, Four of Cups, and the King of Wands. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy as well. So we got the King of Wands and Queen of Wands here. But I feel like someone's stuck in their head about a decision or something that they did not like. Someone took some type of action that someone did not like. Why is the movement choices and decisions here? So two of swords, so stuck at a fork in the road or actually blind to a situation. Why is movement choices and decisions here? Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn's energy. I, I keep 
keep getting that there's some juggling going on. We got the Two of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy. Two of Pentacles is there's this juggling act, okay? Especially being tied up here with the Two of Swords. That further lets me know that, you know, there's just indecision here. Knight of Pentacles is Capricorn's energy, but things were moving possibly slow. Why the Knight of Pentacles here? It's like, I'm not sure what's taking so long. Knight of Pentacles. Why is Knight of Pentacles here? Yeah. Not sure what's taking so long for someone to make this decision. So maybe you went ahead and made a decision. Because in the past, it's saying that there was uncertainty on why why things are moving so slow. Waiting for somebody to make some type of decision. Why is awareness here? What's crowning this situation is something that's coming to the light. Why is awareness here? Someone didn't want to make a decision or someone was dragging their feet making that decision. Why is awareness here? Ooh, Ten of Swords. Ooh. So there could possibly be a betrayal or there's an ending here. Okay. We got Justice card here at the bottom of the deck. So there could be a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius involved. But this could also symbolize like a divorce. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Ooh. Three of Wands. Okay. That's waiting. Waiting for some chips to come in. Somebody wants to be single. Somebody is saying that they want to be single. So maybe you know that you need to end things. You possibly have been waiting for this person to make a decision. Why is accelerated motion here? Hang man. You could be waiting for someone to reach out to you. Um, because you possibly feel left out in the cold, okay? You possibly are feeling left out in the cold or rejected. I'm picking up, we got Queen of Cups keep popping out, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Five of Cups. Is somebody regretting something? Somebody having regrets and feeling left out in the cold? Why is the hangman here? Yeah, waiting for somebody to stand up for you or defend you. Um, and you're kind of worried, okay? So maybe you were waiting for somebody to stand, waiting for someone to stand their ground or to face you, to call you and face you. Um, but I'm getting that there's waiting for some type of communication. Yeah, waiting for somebody to ooh, speak their truth because you, you know that this person has been lying, not telling the truth, um, and you want them to stand up and face you. Ace of Swords. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Okay, the opportunity you the opportunity is going to be in the near future. I'm not sure if they're going to take that opportunity, but I feel like you guys are waiting for someone to face you and tell the truth or stand their ground, or you feeling like you have to stand your ground and speak in your truth. Hmm. We got Like half of someone's check or balancing their money. Somebody was saying that they was possibly having financial issues, calling and telling you their problems. And their problems could be that it could be something about their finances. I'm getting like helping. Maybe you've been helping somebody.
Mm-hmm. I feel like a lot of you guys possibly have been helping someone that is a sneak, liar, cheat. Okay, they possibly had you in the middle of a third-party situation and you found out or you wanted to make something known. Okay, you're waiting for them to uh, face you because I feel like you've been help. I feel like you've been helping somebody out here. Feel like you're afraid to get dropped, and you're feeling uncertain in your in your in your head about it. Okay, you're in your head about it. We got two of swords and nine of swords. You're in your head about it, and you're worried that you possibly could be dropped. We got King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay, I feel like you're in your head big time, and you possibly are worried about feeling stuck or feeling, you know. If you're going to be dropped by this person. You're dealing with a player. Somebody is back and forth, in and out, all over the place. Okay? I don't see anything good coming out of this, Leo's, to be honest. I really don't. How does this person feel about Leo's? How does this person feel about Leo? I got wedding and deception. Let your friends help you. So someone could be married. See, look, deception came up again. Some, someone here could be married and they're sneaking out. And I keep getting, let your friends help you. So some of you guys are possibly getting info and help from friends. Okay, let's see. Ooh. All right, we got flirt. Okay, so you guys chemistry possibly... Is on point because there's a lot of flirting, okay? But it's lighthearted, okay? So they possibly flirt with you. All right, what other messages? How do they feel about Leo's? We got deception. It, it came out, and then look, we got separation at the bottom of the deck. So this person could be separated because I kept picking up on that someone is living with someone or is married or already in some type of commitment and they could be separated or very soon there could be a separation. Okay. There could be time apart from this part. This person, this person could possibly like just kind of like out of blue ghost and you know, isn't nowhere to be found and try to come back around. But we got deception. Someone is wearing a false mask, okay? Give me one more card for Leo's. How do they feel about Leo? We got trust, okay. Ooh, we got children at the bottom. Okay, we got children. Um, I'm gonna clarify. Okay, we have the situation is calling for you to have faith. So there could be trust issues, but with that children at the bottom of the deck, I wanna grab a few clarifiers. All right, so let's see flirt, 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 flirt. Why is flirt here? How do they feel about Leo's? Two of Wands. Maybe you aren't in communication with this person. Okay. Um, Why is the Two of Wands here? Maybe you guys made, you know, were making plans. Why is the Two of Wands here? Two 
Okay, a change of plans is what I'm getting. Okay. Somebody is like distant, has been distancing themselves. Somebody's looking for somebody, has been doing some spying. Somebody made some plans and somebody went ghost. Okay. Why is deception here? Why is deception here? Why is deception here? A lot of cards wanted to jump out with. Why is deception here? Ooh, okay. Three of wands. Okay. Three, the number three. And then we have the nine of cups and the four of cups. Okay. So someone doesn't want someone because someone... <laughs> Someone does not want someone because they are a liar. They're sneaky. Why is the three of wands here? Someone is caught in a third party situation is what I'm picking up on. Three of wands, yeah. Somebody is waiting for communication from somebody. To tell some type of secret. Okay, something somebody does not want to be in the dark anymore, does not want to be a secret. Somebody wants to communicate, or somebody is waiting for somebody to say that they're together, or because something here is surrounded around deception. Okay. We got trust, okay? Why is trust here? Three. Three of cups, lots of threes here. There could be three children involved. There could be some getting together or, um, yeah, we got the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn energy. Someone keeps asking or keeps two of pentacles and a page of pentacles. So this is a conversation. But I'm picking up keep asking about someone or getting together. Three of cups. This could be friends. Okay. Three of cups. Six of swords. Someone is constantly playing with someone's emotions as well, too. Someone is playing with someone's emotions. I even got the Knight of Wands and the Seven of Swords right next to each other. Got King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Somebody is most definitely being manipulative and playing games, okay? And someone is playing with someone's emotions. Be careful, Leos. I'm going to get in together and possibly going on some type of trip. Mine's the Six of Swords here. King of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, Nine of Cups, Four of Wands, Lovers, Empress. Someone has a wife, is what I'm picking up on. But they act single. And someone is wanting some sex, okay? Someone is wanting some sex. Be careful. Be careful, Leos. I'm getting like someone wants to go out of town or go on some type of trip, get together and go out of town or something. Page of Pentacles. Yep, Ace of Wands. Someone wants, you know, it's talking about sexual energy, Okay, but I keep picking up on. Be careful. Be careful, Leos. All right, so that's going to be the message that I have for Leos. If this message resonated, make sure you leave a thumbs up. Let me know what's going on in the comment section below, my loves. All right, until next time. Ciao for now.